Hi guys, what's up? It's Dory. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm filming my everyday makeup routine for those really quick mornings and also I'm showing you my outfit of the day. So I hope you enjoy this video and let's get to it. Okay, so first things first, I'm gonna be using I'm gonna be using my not so favorite foundation brush. I like to use like a more round one like this, but I'm gonna be using a flat one just because I do have to wash this one. So I have to get my eyebrows done, but I try not to pick at them um, just because it's bad. I'm just gonna go in with some foundation. I'm using the L'Oreal Lumi foundation. Probably gonna go a shade darker next time that I get this. This is like a very natural look. And this foundation is so light, so I absolutely love it. It's like really rainy and gloomy out today. So my skin has gotten a lot better ever since I started using less products, ironically, um, and keeping it more simple, my skincare routine. And I used to have really bad acne and thank God it's clearing up. And I wanna get to a point where I don't even have to wear foundation. I mean, I love the foundation feel and look, but I kinda just wear it to be honest, just because I like to cover up like any Imperfection. I absolutely love the L'Oreal Lumi True Match Foundation. It's healthy luminous makeup. It's SPF 20 and it actually feels healthy. It's very light and it just gives you this like stunning glow. It's definitely not full coverage, I wouldn't say, but for school or for like running errands or something quick like a casual day out it's definitely really really nice I feel like it's really dark in here I'm gonna use my Anastasia Beverly Hills glow kit which is my recent fave although it's a little bit of an older kit but still I recently got my hands on it and I'm so 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 excited because it was discontinued and then yeah now it's not my everyday look is using this shade over here which is bronze you're just gonna go in and put it all over your lid super easy I'm actually using my blending brush right now to put it all over my lid if you don't have this kit I really recommend that you get yourself I really recommend that you get your hands on it because it's just beautiful okay I think I'm gonna have to move the camera because the lighting from this angle absolutely sucks so one minute okay I'm back I got better lighting so that's pretty exciting and then once I'm done with the bronzed I just like to go in with summer and put it like in my inner corners just like really effortless and then you can go in with the same color and just put it underneath your brow bone a little bit of a difference <laughs> my left eye today's bronzer is the Bourjois Paris bronzing powder filled with glints of sunshine it has like little chocolates on it It's weird, but it looks like this and it's actually a really good bronzer. I've been using it for years You should probably be using a different brush for this, but I'm kind of feeling this and I'm doing a really super natural look usually I use a bigger more fluffier brush to like really bronze my whole entire face but when you do a natural look, I feel like you don't bronze everything. You just really go for those cheekbones. And you can really get this bronzer at your local drugstore. I don't think it's found at a Walmart, but you can definitely find it at like shoppers or 
I'm not sure what Americans have, like CVS. I'm using this kit, it's the Rimmel London. It's supposed to be a contouring kit. It has like a highlighter, a bronzer, and a blush, but the bronzer is way too dark. Um, so I kind of just use the blush. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous blush. It just like instantly gives your face life. Yeah, sometimes I skip concealer, but I'm gonna go in and put a little bit of concealer right now. I just love doing my concealer last. Like, I don't know what it is, but when I'm in a hurry, I just love doing it at the very end. And then something that I've been loving recently, like this is something that I've been doing a lot lately, is I take my, um, I take the shade Summer in my Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit, and I honestly put it in my inner corners, but I also bring it down. I don't know if you can see that, but I bring it down. I don't know why, but I just really love that look. I think it makes me, I think it makes you look very like awake and glowy. Oh, and I totally forgot to blend this concealer here. It just gives you this like instant glow. It looks like you put in so much effort into your makeup when really it just took you two seconds so loving that and then I'm literally just I'm almost done I'm gonna highlight using moonstone it's a little bit more of a natural highlighter put it on my forehead as well I just love looking like a little diamond <laughs> like I love glowing and then quickly for my brows I'm gonna brush them up and coat them with my with any mascara this is one of my tricks that I always talk about so you run the risk of like getting it on your skin but like I don't know if you can tell already the difference between this brow and this brow I just I got like makeup on I get makeup on my eyebrows while I do my makeup so I like to just coat them with some mascara and give them like a darker more intense look the look is basically done I'm gonna put on my favorite favorite natural very beautiful lipstick this is the bamboo pink by Clinique I absolutely love this shade because it's very similar to my own natural lip color and it also has this like a beautiful glow to it I'll show you what I mean so I'm gonna put it on I'm like trying to look cute over here I'll show you what I mean So beautiful I'm obsessed with this color like if you do not have this lipstick you have to get your hands on it because it is the perfect nude the makeup is done and I absolutely love this makeup routine because it's simple it's easy and it just makes you look very glowy and healthy and at the same time it's very effortless you don't have to put in so much effort yet it looks like you did so definitely give this look a try and let's go pick an outfit welcome to my little closet I actually like to arrange my clothes by colors so like if I know if I'm feeling like wearing black or white or whatever it is I go right away to that section and I pick what I want to wear um, but it's kind of messy right now so the colors are a little bit messed up just because I haven't had the time to really sit and arrange everything I mostly wear like whites blacks grays and blues I don't wear a lot of color but let's see what I'm gonna pick today so I always like to lay out what I'm gonna wear on my bed I'm gonna wear these pants they're like these like joggery pants but like they're very nice material with this gray turtleneck because it's really cold out today and then I'm gonna throw this on top this is from H&M I'm just gonna throw this on top in case it's um it gets cold because it's very windy out let me go put this on and show you what it looks like so this is what I'm wearing so easy and comfy for those lazy days and then I like to keep my turtleneck up I don't know it's just how I rock my turtlenecks and I actually paired this look with these Michael Kors boots and yeah very runway chic vibes 
Okay guys, so that is what I am wearing today. This is my everyday makeup routine. I hope you loved it. I am off to conquer the day. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.